Whatever the weather. Check on the BBC Weather app. All the latest from BBC News now on BBC Two. You're with the BBC live from London. On the 25th anniversary of the Good Friday Agreement being signed, the British Prime Minister calls for power sharing to return to Northern Ireland. Chinese military forces conduct drills around Taiwan for a third day. The display of force is Beijing's angry response to a visit by the Taiwanese president to the US. Two bodies are found in the rubble of a building in Marseille 24 hours after it collapsed in an explosion. And Elon Musk says the BBC is among the least biased news organisations. It's in response to the BBC's objections to being labelled as government-funded media on its main Twitter account. Hello and welcome to the programme. We begin in Northern Ireland, which is marking 25 years since the signing of the Good Friday Agreement. The historic peace deal largely ended decades of violence in Northern Ireland. But Prime Minister Rishi Sunak says efforts must be intensified to restore the power-sharing government that was central to the deal. It collapsed in the fallout from Brexit, and now the political dysfunction and security concerns are threatening to overshadow the historic milestone. From Belfast, Laura Curran reports. It took 22 months of talks to largely end three decades of conflict.